The sport of pickleball has enjoyed a boom in popularity over the last few years, but it's usually played in gymnasiums or community centers. But now avid picklers in Toronto have a brand new venue to call their own. We have over 30,000 pickleball players in the GTA and people are sometimes playing in curling rinks, old hockey arenas because they have no place to play. We have a lot of people that are itching to play in the winter time and we just simply don't have the supply needed for all of these courts. In addition to four professional courts, the Jar Pickleball Club in North York also has several amenities, including a sauna, a cold plunge, and a workout room. More than enough to hook this newbie to the sport. This is actually my first time playing ever. I don't know the rules, I don't know what I'm doing at all, but it's a lot of fun. All ages can play pickleball. That's the beauty of it. It's easy to learn. It's easy to learn, it's easy to pick up, it's a social sport. Uh, so it was bound it was bound to come where uh, the younger generation is gonna pick up on it and learn uh, the beauty of the game. I think that is the, the biggest selling point of pickleball is the accessibility of it. Um, it's very easy to learn, but hard to master. Speaking of master picklers, look no further than Mark Godfrey, a member of Toronto United and a reigning national champion. Once you see the pace of the ball, you know, at the kitchen line going back and forth in a live event, then you really, you know, give it some respect and, and say, wow, this is really, you know, fast paced. Uh, I can't really do this. <laughs> Baseball has bases. Yeah. Basketball has a basket. Football, sometimes you kick it with your foot. Why is the sport called pickleball? Why is the sport called pickleball? You know what? I think you would have to go back to the founders in the 1960s. <laughs> That's a good question. You know what? I actually don't have the answer to that question. Some people think it was named after a dog. Some people will think it was named after a rowing boat. The boat was called Pickles, and it was out in uh, Seattle, Washington. That's what you're going with. Yes, that's what I'm going with. I kind of like the dog story better. <laughs> so if you're in a bit of a pickle when it comes to your personal fitness, or you're just looking to have a little bit of fun, this might be the perfect spot just for you. At the Jar Pickleball Club, Rob Leth, City News. Oh.